If you've already claimed your business on Google, the next thing you will need to do is to verify it so Google can confirm you are the legitimate owner of the business or at the very least, the right person to manage the business details online. Verifying your business is a must if you want to appear in Google search results and Google Maps, control how your business is represented online and get the chance of driving more customers to your business. The verification process is very simple, but for those of you who are still unsure how it's done, stay tuned and I'll show you how. I'm Luke Durand, the founder of RankingAcademy.co.uk, the place where small business owners turn to for better online visibility, more traffic to their website and more customers to their stores. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel or like this video as it will help me create additional tutorials for you. Before I can show you how to verify your business on Google, you have to claim your business through Google My Business first. If you haven't done it yet, check out my video how to add your business to Google Maps in two steps. It will show you how it's done. As soon as you complete the process of claiming your business, you will be taken to your business profile, which look very similar to this. At the top of the profile, in the blue ribbon, you should see a message confirming you requested verification via postcard, which is the most common way of verifying a single business. You can also verify your business via phone, which I will cover in just a couple of minutes. After a few days, you should receive a postcard sent from Google to the address you've used to claim your business online uh, in Google My Business. On the postcard, when you open it, you will find the address you need to go to in order to verify your business, which is google.com slash verify my business. And on the postcard, there is also a verification code, as you can see on the screen here. Uh, the example here is 12345, and this is the code you will need to verify your business. So let me show you how it's done. So there are a couple of ways to verify your business. Uh, let's start with the first one, which is following the recommendation uh, or the instructions, I should say, that you have on your postcard. So simply go to the recommended URL, which is in this case, in this case, google.com slash verify my business. Once you get there, just log into your account. Uh, I've got quite a few accounts here, so I'm going to use a dummy account I've created for the sake of this video. I'm going to log in and then straight after that you will see uh, I've got a list of businesses here and it's asking me which one I want to verify. So I'm going to check the one that I want to verify, the first one here and all I need to do is put the verification code that was on the postcard into this little box. So one, two, three, four, five. Obviously this is not going to work because it's all dummy data and then I submit and once you've done that Google will confirm you have verified your business just as simple as that. So let's now have a look at a second method uh, of verifying your business account. Simply go to Google and search for Google My Business and this will bring up the Google My Business uh, link right at the top, click on that and sign in using the Google account that you've used to create your Google My Business profile. So we're going to use the same account here and this will take you to your profile where you will see if you scroll down to locations area where the locations of your business or your businesses, I should say, are. So in this instance, for uh, this example, I've got three different locations, none of which have been verified because they're all dummy accounts. And as you can see, they are pretty much the same as we've seen in the previous example. There's this two way of doing this. You can either click on the manage location link on the card that you want to check, which is right here. And that's gonna take you to the business profile page of that very business. And as you can see, it's very similar to the one that we've seen earlier in this video, except that in the blue ribbon, we've got the enter code uh, button. Click on that, and again, it's gonna take you to the very same screen that we've seen before, where you can enter your verification code. Another way of doing this is just click straight into the get verified link in the card, 
which will take you straight to the verification box. Once again, enter the code and you will be verified by Google. So once you've entered your verification code and you've actually verified your business, it may take a few days before your listing is actually published and visible in Google results and Google Maps. Um, and you probably want to find out whether or not your listing is live. In order to do that, go back to Google My Business a few days after you've entered your verification code and log into your account. So this time I'm gonna use the uh, account details of a business that's already been verified so you can see exactly what you can expect. Um, so let's go ahead and sign in. Okay, so once you've signed in, uh, you should access the dashboard of your Google My Business. Scroll down to the locations area, which we've already seen before. There are three types of ways to display your business or businesses. There is the card views, which is currently the one that we're seeing. There's a list view and a map view. You can toggle through these options using the button right here. Within the card view option, you will see a clear publish notification, um, which obviously tells you your Google listing is live. If you don't see this, that means your business is still pending. If you switch to the list view, you will see the exact same information under the status column right here. So both these businesses have been published and are live in Google. Within the list view, you can actually see what your business will look like within Google search results and Google Maps. Simply click on the three dots next to the store icon right here. And then you've got the options to choose where you want to see your business so in this instance let's pick Google search and that is going to take you to your Google my business card which will be displayed when people are looking for your business in Google right let's now have a look at what your business will look like in Google Maps so let's repeat that again and choose Google Maps here we go and this is what it's gonna look like Let's now go back to the cards view where you can actually do something similar under the cards that you want to check. You can actually click on the view on search. So let's pick this business for instance. And here we go. This is exactly the same results as we've seen before. As mentioned earlier on, some select businesses may be eligible for phone verification. It is unclear which type of businesses Google would deem as select, but let's run through an example anyway. Go to google.com my business and log into your account. So again, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna use uh, an example here of a, the dummy account that I've created. Okay, scroll down to the locations area and select the business you want to verify. Right, as you can see here, we've got a business which has the option to be verified by phone. So click the call button to activate the automated messaging where a verification code will be given to you at that particular number. Once you receive the verification code, it's the same process as before, simply enter it. And once you've entered the verification code, just click on submit and Google will verify your business listing. This is it. Verify your business listing as soon as you can and increase your chances of being found by new customers. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Don't hesitate to post your comments or questions below as I will respond to them directly so everybody can benefit from the answers. And if you can, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and better still, subscribe to my YouTube channel for more tutorials. See you soon.